We're here checking out the Lenovo ThinkBook Transparent Display Laptop. It's a concept right now, but the most interesting part about it, as I mentioned in the name, is the fact that the display is transparent. You can see through it from this side and from the other side. It's a huge display at 17.3 inches. There's a layer of micro LED sandwiched between two layers of glass, which means it's fragile a little bit. One of the clear benefits of a transparent display is that because you can see everything behind you, it's sort of like having an Apple Vision Pro or any other sort of AR headset on your head. And you don't need extra cameras or anything because you actually see what's behind the laptop and you can overlay what you're working on on what's in the real world. But in order for the computer to also see what's behind you, there's a camera at the bottom of the laptop. The top of the keyboard is made of glass as well and it switches between multiple colors a tactile feedback is basically inexistent because it's a layer of glass, obviously. And the trackpad I found is a bit finicky to use because you don't know the limits of it. So if I go to the left or the right, it's not really a trackpad that's only in the middle. What's interesting about it is because it's a layer of glass, it also automatically switches to a drawing pad and you can interact with it with the stylus. Obviously, the big question mark here is around privacy and this is one of the reasons this isn't available to buy right now because if you want to use it in public, everyone can see what's behind the laptop and what you're working on. The other downside is that the glass is fragile and personally, I wouldn't carry this or work on it because it's a huge layer of glass on the top and on the bottom. One of the issues we see on this concept is the fact that the brightness is not adjustable, but the technology is there to make the brightness adjustable. So with this current unit, the brightness is blazing and the display is going up to 1000 nits. So if you're just working in a dark environment and you have a black background and some white text or even some white background and a black text, everything contrasty looks very weird and anything black on your screen it is it's just the micro leds are not firing up and there's nothing happening there whereas everything white or any other color uses the micro leds to fire up so there's no deep black the black isn't black on this display it's basically just what's behind the display what you're seeing overall it's a really interesting concept and we're glad we saw it but i think the technology is not really there maybe in a couple of years once all of the issues have been ironed out it'll be ready what do you guys think let me know in the comments and don't forget to follow android authority for all the latest mwc coverage